Good afternoon, YouTube. This is Clarence, and uh, I'm here with another video, a repair video, uh, information video, however you want to call it. But um, anyway, <clears throat> this one is about um, how to stop squeaky belts, serpentine belts, alternator belts, whatever kind of belts you got. Um, all I know is the belts are squeaking, and um, we need to get it stopped, okay? Uh, there's a couple of things you can use. You can use uh, WD-40, which is a water-based solution. You can take um, dishwashing detergent out of your kitchen and mix it with some water, whether it's Joy or any kind of whatever brand it is. You mix some of that with some water in a spray bottle, and you can spray it, and you can get the same results. Um, when I was growing up as a kid, I always used um, WD-40 because that's what my pops told me to use. And um, it works almost any kind of household products that has a um, wet base, lubricant base to it will work. Because the alternator belts are <clears throat> pretty much made out of some of the similar same material that your tires are made out of with an exception of the... Um, the uh, wire cords that's in the tires. If it's environmental friendly, it'll work on them belts and it won't damage the belt, regardless of what somebody tell you. If they tell you, oh, you can't put this on there because it's gonna damage your belt and ruin your engine. And that's a lie. Those belts are durable, tough, and um, if it's a household product, you can put it on there. I, um, I'm gonna use WD-40, but you can mix um, some household detergent with some water and spray those spray your belts if it's squeaking the whole point behind this is to stop squeaking and a friend of mine today um, was talking about their belts and that's why I came up with the idea of this video so what I'm going to use is I'm going to use WD-40 now I have a bottle of Aquafina but that's just for me to drink. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, but anyway, <clears throat> back to business. What I'm gonna be using is I'm gonna be using this WD-40. It's a water base, and I got a little um, straw on it that I can actually get to the belt. So what you want to do is you want to try to spray the belt mostly towards the inside of the belt. The outer, outer don't matter, but get as much as you can on the inside. Uh, also avoid spraying near your alternator. Stay away from your alternator and um, just spray the inside of the belt. Don't take a whole lot. Just take a little bit and it'll stop the squeak, okay? All right. Okay, I'm back. Here's my engine. And um, what I was telling you was, you want to spray, try to stay away from <clears throat> electrical stuff. Um, so when I look in here, I'm going to put my light over here. But um, this thing is jam packed. So when I look in here, I have a pointer. This is my alternator right here. This is my belt right here. So what I don't want to do is I don't want to spray this alternator. So I want to spray this belt mostly on the inside track as possible. But I'm not going to spray here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move to this side over here. And I'm going to spray away from the alternator, which is electrical, and get over here where there's no electrical at, and spray the belt. Okay. We're going to put this right, that light right there. And here's the belt, the same belt over here. So I'm going to spray here, because if I can get it on this pulley right here, which is one of my compressors for my, the compressor pulley for the um, AC, and then the back side I'm not really concerned with, but I want to get it down. I really want to get it down here, okay? All the way down to where this rod is at. That's the inside of the belt. Right there is where you're going to make your money at, and it's going to stop that squeaking. Okay? 
So, I take my WD-40, water-based WD-40, and I put the can in here. Now, if you don't trust yourself and you don't want to get something caught up, make sure your engine is turned off, okay? And then just spray your belt. I'm going to spray it, okay? I'm going to spray all up here in the pulley. And I'm going to spray all up here. Pull my can out. And I'm going to spray up here and spray the belt too, okay? And there's a spot right here I can reach. I can get there and I can spray. So I just sprayed the belt. I have my engine turned off. If you are a rookie and you're new and you're not sure, please turn your engine off and spray. Once you spray, start your engine, but close the hood first, and it will stop the squealing. If your belts are open and you don't have all this stuff right here in the way that I got, that I have in the way, all this stuff, and you can get to your belts um, with no, with no um, blockage, you can spray it with the engine running, but I prefer or I recommend Spray it with the engine off. You're going to get the same results. Then start your engine with the hood down and the squealing will be gone. Okay? I use WD-40. I got me a cool bottle of Aquafina. But it's just for drinking. I'm only drinking... And that's pretty much it, okay? <clears throat> okay, so I'm back. Um, I just sprayed it, started the engine up, everything is running fine, and squealing is gone. And all I used was WD-40. You can use Households Good. Almost anything that's environmental friendly, you can use to keep that squeaking down on those belts, okay? It's done. Uh, I even had to, once again, I even had to hydrate myself with a little bit of aquafina and water. Uh, hint, hint. And um, I'm Clarence. My belt squeaking is gone. Um, it's on you. Check out my video. If you like it, give me the thumbs up. If you don't like it, Give me the thumbs down. And I think they still do the bell thing in there where you can click on the bell, ring that bell. Um, also sign up for the notification so the next video comes out, you can get a copy of the video. I'm Clarence. Peace. And we'll see you next time.